On WRAL, one person is in the hospital and a Walmart is closed after a shooting inside the store. It happened on the busiest shopping day of the year. Hello and thanks for joining us. I'm Gerald Owens. And I'm Michelle McConaughey. It happened at the Walmart in Lumberton. The store is off I-95 right on Fayetteville Road. Chelsea Donovan joining us live from the scene after speaking with someone who was in the store when it happened. Chelsea, he didn't waste time in jumping in to help people. Absolutely not, Gerald. Shane Baker has been in this Walmart more times than he can count. He's actually from Lumberton, and today he showed bravery amid the chaos and the terror, simply, as he says, to make sure others made it out okay. A sea of open parking spaces, empty shopping carts, a closed Walmart. Not your typical Black Friday scene. We were coming to Walmart here uh, in Lumberton to just pick up a few items. Shane Baker and his wife were shopping in the grocery section about 1130 this morning. And we began to hear some arguing that began to escalate. Something and told him to act hard. fast. I heard the arguing begin to become more aggressive and more aggressive and immediately I knew that something was about to happen. I said, let's go ahead and get down. Just get down, get down. Get... By the time we got on the floor, pop, 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 pop. He ran into the first open door, corralling a dozen people with him. I seen a door to, that goes into the freezer section, whatever. Let's get inside. Let's get in here. Let's get in here. I knew that I had to protect not only my wife, but I had to protect these folks in there with me. When he walked back out to see if police arrived. And I heard the guy make a threat as far as I'll kill everybody in here. Lumberton police scoured the Walmart as it was being evacuated, looking for the shooter and any victims. About that time, Shane Baker and the others he found refuge with found a back door to escape. That's when he captured this video. A live uh, threatening uh, situation right here. You can see Lumberton police crawling all over the Walmart. They say two people got into an argument. One person was shot and has non-life-threatening injuries. The suspect still hasn't been found, but was seen on surveillance video running out of the store. As for Baker, he says he's mired in emotions. Anxiety, uh, but adrenaline kind of mixed, thinking about what could have happened or it could have been a tremendous loss for us today, for me, or my life could have been took. And Gerald, at this hour, Lumberton police have still not yet released the name of that shooter, that suspect that they still have not found, or the victim who was shot earlier this morning.